uh, a lot of reading. Oh, I already kind of crashed this hole. I ain't done here. As much as I want to, like, get a rocket launcher, I really can't be bothered to turn around and get the rocket launcher parts. Activating security scan. Biometric data assembled. Subject recognized. Access. Granted. Me or the guy talking to you? An innocent man. Yeah, I'm sure. Not the bell tower. Ammo capacity. Does this need that? No. What about? Uh, my pistol could use a lot of upgrades. I don't really use a shotgun. Damage output. Nothing. You are the terrorists. Yeah, I'm sure. Or about the guns. Hit the alarm. Hit the alarm. I'm tired of being sneaky. Do you? Oh, you're right there. I thought they were below me. Why would they be below me when I have to go up? It's okay. What you're doing here is wrong. I do want to get that upgrade again.
Alright, so... Are we able to just waltz up the center? Silo? Oh no, this is level 4. I win. <clears throat> Keitner, Jensen, I'm in your detention camp and uploading to the security mainframe now. Copy that. Any problems? Nothing I couldn't get rid of. Yeah, well, we'll talk about that later. Right now, you need to get inside the interrogation wing and find out what Burke is hiding. Contact me when you know. Keitner out. I do want to get in there. This one's going to be a huge pain. All right. Instant. Okay. Detected. Oh, based. Ah, damn. Not quite. Access. Don't wake him up. He's sleeping. He's sleeping. Don't wake him up. Oh, 
was lucky on the detection stuff earlier. It ain't gonna happen again. I won't be able to get it. Very unfortunate. I don't want to lose my attempts. It's bad neither of these guys had the password. Oh! Ow? God damn it. Let me, uh... I'm just, like, fucking around. <laughs> I do really want to get in there. Jensen, I'm in your detention camp and uploading to the security mainframe now. If only I had another point just to do stealth. Copy that. Any problems? Nothing I couldn't get rid of. Yeah, well, we'll talk about that later. Right now, you need to get inside the interrogation wing and find out what Burke is hiding. Contact me when you know. Keitner out. Instant. I don't really care about setting off the alarm, to be honest. Access denied. Someone can stop ahead of you. Come get me. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm just gonna stop hacking. I was gonna try to, like, you know, get in there. That's, like, the security one. Try to get in there, turn off some of the stuff, but it's just not meant to be. But that's Kiker. okay. Jensen, I'm in your detention camp and uploading to the security mainframe now. Copy that. Any problems? Nothing I couldn't get rid of. Yeah, well, we'll talk about that later. Right now, you need to get inside the interrogation wing and find out what Burke is hiding. Contact me when you know. Keitner out. How? Yo, that's quite a bit of money. Don't know when I'll be able to buy more Praxis, but you know. Yeah. These things are just patrolling. How are they doing? These little tank things suck. Be tough. Sound the alarm. They find my friend. Uh oh. A 
lasers, though. Uh, hang on. How do I throw grenades again? Was the thing? Oh. <sighs> Where'd you go? Right here. another one or is he is that one below okay where are the stairs up I like use these rooms as like break rooms and shit rape rooms as well pretty fucked up There's the third one. I don't have any more EMPs though. The fuck is that? Alright, made it through flawlessly. Activating security scan. Biometric data assembled. I expected it to be like, nope. This place is creepy. Oh, these are the interrogation rooms. I need to be... So it seems like at the end of the level. I'm sorry, I'll, I'll stay quiet, I promise. Just don't hurt me anymore. Calm down. I'm not gonna hurt you. You're not one of them? One of the scientists? Please, you've got to get me out of here. You've got to do something before they come back. I don't want to disappear like all the others. Hold on. You said they were coming back? Who? Burke? Is he behind this? I... I'm not sure. He comes around, but not that often. 
I know he gives the orders around here, but he doesn't seem all that interested in us, to be honest, and cites us for questioning. He mostly leaves us to the doctors or the scientists or whatever they are. Tell me about these scientists. Is one of them a woman named Reed? I don't know. I mean, there is a woman, but her name is Kavanaugh, not Reed. I heard the guard call her that. Seems different, like she doesn't like what they're doing to her. I can't help but think she's being forced to do these things. The others just treat us like animals. It's horrible. I just want to go home. It's okay. What's your name? Nina. Well, Nina. Uh, Cape Town. I take it you're not a terrorist, then? No. I've never done anything wrong. Never demonstrated against anything or anything. But neither have most of the girls here. I'm not sure about the men, but please. I know this is going to seem cruel. You're going to leave me here? I can't have you tagging along just yet, or walking the halls alerting the guards. <laughs> Trust me. When I can get you out, I will. But your best bet is to stay put. Oh, I'll alert them anyway. Burke and the two doctors were just here heading for the morgue. I'll tell them you're here. I will. Let me out or I'll tell them, I swear. And then what? Do you really think they'll let you go? I'm still the best chance you've got. Please. What? Let her out so she can be a dumbass? Like... What does she think she's going to do? Data storage device. Big hand, we got a thing here to interrogate you. What's going on so down what here? What did these ones die of, Savage? A complete neurological breakdown from the looks of it. Organ collapse, nerve degradation. Find him. There's been some trouble on the base. My man will take care of it. You were saying? We may be looking at serious cross-systemic failure issues with the OCM. It's those god-awful implants, Gary. The whole inhumane procedure. After a while, it just burns them out. Has this been happening at the other sites? We've experienced some die-off, yes. But I've been told Dr. Reed's research may offer a breakthrough. If we could bring her back here... That's not going to happen. Then we need to start considering other options. A nanotech-based solution performed on willing volunteers. And are you volunteering yourself, Doctor? Tiffany, please. I need to look at the raw data, Commander. If you would. I turned a blind eye to your little office romance, Savage. But if she becomes a problem, she will be volunteering. Quack, quack. Kreitner, I found out what Burke's been concealing. The interrogation wing is some kind of medical testing facility. He's using the prisoners as lab rats. For what? Not sure. I'll need Burke's retinal scan data to find out. Good thing I picked I up that thing. I can't download that without setting off a million alarms. However, you still have that retinal prosthesis you stole from his office? If you're suggesting I use it to fool a retinal scanner, it won't work. The eye synthetic tissue spike needs to be connected to a real optic nerve. Otherwise, it just reads as metal. I know. That's why you need to take it to Quinn. I'll tell him to expect you. Keitner out.
Oh, I gotta go all the way back. <laughs> Takes forever to get anywhere here. Yeah. I go all the way back. I do this again. Activating security scan. No quick way up and down here. Oh, yeah. <sighs> I really wish I didn't have to do this DLC. See, I didn't kill everyone. I think there's still two dudes. This is illegal. You can't keep us locked up. Oh my god. How many times do I gotta fucking shoot him? I am trying to shoot across the world with a uh, pistol. I could turn everything off around here now. doesn't really matter anymore. I wouldn't have been able to hack the robots anyway. <sighs> Alrighty. Might not be that long of a walk. I mean, I did take forever getting here. Oh, right. This part. Oh, these guys, some more guys here. This is the spot. Keep looking. Someone must be there. Oh, I still didn't turn off the lasers here. Someone's fooling around. Someone's fooling around. Uh, you call dead bodies fooling around? Pretty rude. I just noticed that. They're very alarmed. Access. 
Request granted. Money. Another silencer. Put it on our combat rifle. Fuck it. No, I don't have 04 anymore, do I? Yeah. I didn't save that. That's just the thing. Moving refrigerators. Alright. Does this one go in the fritz too, or is it just the one? I think I'll just level up hacking. Just make it a bit easier. Oh, we gotta go way up there. Please? Please? Damn. Access granted. Really hoping that was gonna be like something for the lasers, maybe, but just emails and a waste of my cracking time. Hello. I heard you. Hello. <laughs> Do I gotta jump back up there? This one go on the fritz too or These data storage devices. Emails. Her. It's only level one. Instantly found at fifteen percent. What is that ASCII art of? I can't tell. Sort of that, uh, 
Or do I have I come through here? I guess I did. Maybe I didn't. More emails? Sign me up. Because I can. Access granted. A lot of reading that I will not be doing. Uh, uh, right. The cameras are off now. Is that guy to my right? Hold it. I can't breathe. Also shooting. I'm like kind of over this game and DLC at this point. I'm like, kind of ready for it to be done. I had to move closer. guy, one of Burke's. We needed to get past a retinal scan, but it's useless like this. Aye. Without an active neural connection, it might as well be an expensive paperweight. <laughs> may as well put a gobstopper in front of the scanner for all the good that thing will do you. Solutions, Quinn. Think you can handle this? Lad, I may be just a mechanic, but I'm also the only thing keeping this whole bleeding facility from sinking into the abyss. Think I can manage a simple optic frequency bypass. Just let me get me tools. Right. So that's it now. He got the eye. Sorry it took a little longer than I expected. Nearly break the damn thing once or twice. New TYM firmware and such. Now don't go fucking around with it. It's only got a limited lifespan due to the temp power source they rigged. It's only good for one use. Got it? This is pretty impressive work for a mechanic, Quinn. What's that supposed to mean? There's more old Quinn than meets the eye. No pun intended. You wouldn't be the first fool to underestimate my know-how. Well, there's more to this job than just a simple battery swap. I saw you modifying the BIOS. This is state-of-the-art hardware and software. You're not just a mechanic. You're a hacker. What are you going on about now? Ain't nothing you couldn't pull off with a degree in computer engineering and a little elbow grease. Come off it now. We ain't got time for this. Is it supposed to be moving? Aye. Bloody creepy, that is. Try not to pay it any mind now. Thing's stuck in calibration mode. Trick is, I got it thinking it's plugged into a new host. And by rewriting the system diagnostic checks, it'll keep trying to connect without detecting anything to miss, which in turn keeps it alive in a manner of speaking. Fucking brilliant piece of engineering work if I don't so myself. Beans. Well, hopefully this thing works. It'll work just dandy so long as you don't do something stupid like drop it. And it ain't a bloody webcam. So don't try using it to spy the knickers up someone's skirt. Lol. What are you buying? <laughs> and wish he had another Praxis. I don't really have anything 
I want to sell. So, skedaddle. Thanks for shopping at Quinn Mart. Why well, is it like I could interact with stuff back there? I wonder if the alarms are still going. Oh, yeah, I had to like drop in, didn't I? I don't have to. Actually. Can you just take these vents, right? Got around doing that. feel nearly as painful if it was like not these checkpoints here. Subject recognized. Access granted. Now everyone should be dead here. Activating security scan. <laughs> All right. Jensen, it's Keitner. Where are you? In a well-concealed elevator inside the prison's restricted wing. Your gun-running neural engineer deserves a raise. I take it the eye worked then. Good. Now listen, if what you say is true, if Burke really is using the prisoners here as lab rats, I need proof. Hard evidence that I can take to Interpol. An entire prison full of kidnapped civilians isn't enough? You're an ex-cop, Jensen. You tell me. How many death row inmates crying on about their innocence have you seen getting out? Point taken. I'll see what I can find. God 
Damn, this goes down. The guy go that was with her. Maybe he left already. Oh, I didn't find one of the data thing. Oh, that's what the data thingies are doing. Oh, okay. I didn't realize. I missed one. Yo, Fraxus. Hello, I guess. Quite the house of horrors you got here, Doc. You letting anyone in, or just women? Who are you? How'd you get down here? This is a restricted area. Obviously. You wouldn't want the rank and file knowing what kind of sick experimentation is going on down here. No, you, you don't understand. I'm not. Where's Burke? And your research partner, Savage. Burke went back up to the base. And Gary, Gary left. Told me to be smart, keep my mouth shut, and do whatever Burke tells me to do. For now. For now? I heard the three of you talking up there in the morgue. Sounded like you don't exactly fit in here, Dr. Uh... Kavanagh. And who the fuck are you? The name's Jensen. I came here looking for someone. Megan Reed. Reed? I I've seen her research. Gary thinks it could be the key we're missing. If she can be convinced to come here. Megan Reed was kidnapped, Kavanaugh. Violently. As was her entire scientific team, and the dozens of women you've been torturing down here. No! You, you don't understand. I'm trying to save them. Gary and I, we were sent here to put the OCM project back on track. It wasn't until we got here that we realized what that meant, and by then... By then it was too late. Too late. OCM. Savage used that term in the morgue. What does it mean? Organic Computational Matrix. It's a means of cross-connecting living brain tissue and artificial intelligence systems to create a supercomputer of unparalleled capability. Part flesh, part silicon. That's what you're doing down here, turning prisoners into computer parts. Human brain activity has to be integrated with the technology, or else it won't work. Even DARPA knew that. Just how many prisoners are being wired into God this damn. Thing? I... I don't know. <coughs> But a lot of them don't seem to survive for more than a year. I've told the others there's no way this project can stay viable with these kinds of numbers. But the OCM computers have to have them to work. Computers? You mean there's more than one of them? There's... several. This is just where the process starts. The factory floor. We select the candidates here, implant them, and ship them to the other locations. It's all very efficient. Yeah, except your candidates keep dying. What does DARPA have to do with this? Nothing. Not directly. In 2007, they started looking for research partners to help develop an artificial cognitive science program that could increase a soldier's situational awareness in the field. A number of private sector companies submitted proposals. Bell Tower being one of them? No. Bell Tower was a private military corporation. DARPA wanted researchers. But one of the companies who did submit something was a biotech corporation that deals with Bell Tower. And they believed a successful program could be designed 
if it could be wired directly into the soldiers' brains. DARPA wasn't willing to go that far. So this biotech company took the idea at a bell tower. A corporation that, being privately funded, doesn't have to concern itself with political or ethical debate. You seem to think Megan's research is integral to salvaging this project of yours. Why? It's not my project. Had I known before I came here... Right, just answer the question. <sighs> We're experiencing cross-systemic failures with the tech. Over time, subjects implanted with OCM augmentations suffer complete neurological breakdown. They... they pretty much burn up from the inside. Gary thinks it's a problem with the acceptance of the PDOT array. I've heard that phrase before. It's the building block of modern neuro-augmentations. Dr. Reed's been reshaping it, changing the way it bonds with living tissue. The mutagenic gene combination she's introduced into it, well, frankly, it's astonishing. Enough to warrant her kidnapping? So she'd be forced to work on this project with you? She's not on this project. I don't know what she's doing or where she is. This is the first time anyone's ever mentioned kidnapping. You're really gonna stand there and try to justify your role in this, aren't you? People are being enslaved, Kavanaugh. Enslaved and crucified. It, it wasn't like that at first. I thought we were gonna make a difference, do something incredible for the world. Right. And look how incredible it turned out to be. It seems pointless. But you can still make a difference, Doctor. You can help me blow the lid off this place. Are you insane? I, I can't. There's too much money invested in this. Burke, the people I work for, they'll kill me. They'll hunt me down and kill me. I know people who can protect you, hide you. Interpol is just waiting for evidence to tear Bell Tower apart. It's not just Bell Tower. Oh, God. Oh, God, am I really going to do this? <laughs> you... you can't get me out through the prison. Burke would stop us. Then we'll have to do what Savage did. Take a submersible. We can't. The hatches to all the docking hangers are locked tight. The only way to unlock them is by using the security console in the prison command tower. But keeps an eye on us that way. Then I'll have to go back up there and unlock it. Well, you gather as much evidence as you can carry. Oh my god. I'm really gonna do this. Damn right you are. Now get moving. I'll contact you when I unlock the hatch. All right. Fine. But Mr. Jensen, please, hurry. All right. Trauma kit. A few doses of morphine. Pocket secretary. Oh. I don't really know what any of this, this means. But I got a steam achievement for it. Longest elevator ride back up. Keitner, contact Interpol. We need rendezvous coordinates for a deep sea submersible. A what? What exactly have you found, Jensen? A research complex hidden beneath this base. One of its staff is willing to turn whistleblower if we can deliver her to Interpol using one of the lab's transport subs. Which explains why you need the coordinates. I'll see what I can do. Keitner out. Keitner, what the hell's going on? The elevator stopped. 
Burke must have intercepted our comms. Get the hell out of there, Jensen. I'll meet you. Yeah, how long did you think you'd be able to communicate, right? Something else. What's up, Nightmare? Where was the... Was it in... Oh, it was in here. Yeah, we'll get that. I'll mock that. I was looking for the stamina, dur the stamina duration. Something that would benefit you. Anything could benefit me right now. Whoops. I wanted to throw the box. ain't right what's not right people in the elevator they're probably like on the other side of that door they are only alarmed I'm in your ceiling. stuff. What'd they think was gonna happen? Yo, revolver ammo? It'd be funny if you could somehow actually get up in there. Climb into the elevator, skip all of that retina stuff. How many enemies are back? To do is wait at these security scans. I mean, look how freaking wide open you are. That would be fair, I guess.
We really broke open a hornet's nest, didn't we, Jensen? It's bad. You need a medic. <laughs> yeah, I'll get right on that. You got those coordinates, Jensen. But Burke figured it out. Seized control of the station and locked down the detention camp. Bastard's cleaning house. I've got to get Kavanaugh out. Can't. Not until you stop the gas. What gas? Burke's enacted a scorched earth protocol to stop the truth from getting out. Poison gas in every cell. Lab too. Unless you stop it. I got that trauma Stay kit. with me, Keitner. There's a circuit board underneath the prison command tower. It directs the flow. Everything's connected, but might be able to... Keitner? She's got nothing. What was a trauma kit for, then? Couldn't even, uh... Ease her pain. I know, right? Here, lockdown is complete, and Kitner has been taken care of. This little alarm dude don't really matter anymore. Oh, there's a big old timer? Is that seconds or minutes? Nice. Oh, that's very aggressive. Listening this whole time? Like Zietke said, everything's connected. Right now, gas is set to disperse evenly between the prison and the lab. All you can do in here is redirect flow out of one area into the other. Do nothing. Everybody dies. Do something. Somebody dies faster. Precisely. But if you want to bring down Bell Tower, the choice is clear. Yeah. How do you choose? A difficult decision, Bratan. But that governor nuke bark give you no choice. Tell that to the prisoners. You'll have Interpol rendezvous with Kavanaugh submersible. As soon as you unlock it, use the touch screen in the security room above you. It'll shut off the lockdown, so you can return to the base. And why would I want to go there? Use your head, Chubak. The last thing standing between you and Megan Reed is Burke. All right.
ready if you Very inefficient way to kill, dude. But I'm not judging. Kavanaugh, I've unlocked the hatch and I'm transmitting the coordinates to a rendezvous site. Oh, thank God. I thought when the code yellow started. It's over. Just make sure Interpol gets that evidence. I'm going after Burke. Jensen out. Um I think we'll uh just upgrade our defense. I can't even open the doors. Activating security scan. Like that guy. He's up top, that's right. I wonder if there's a bunch of dudes now. Hey, the lasers are down. I went all sneaky beaky the first time through here. You think I ain't ready to do it again? Although it doesn't really put me behind him, does it?
Where is he shooting us from? They don't understand what the floor is. And the floor is everywhere. Me, bitch. Dude's just gonna be talking shit over the intercom, isn't he? You know, I shouldn't be using this anymore, actually. you yes you did I'm looting oh there's an invisible guy I gotta remember about the invisible guys actually I should probably like stop bucket around Focus back up. Oh man, is he okay? I was like, do I have to listen to him talk God, again? You there, Quinn? Where are you? Getting me ours out of Dodge. Burke's had enough, and he's gunning for you. And I don't intend on being caught in the bloody crossfire. But listen, about the gas. I knew it wasn't easy, but you did what had to be done. Head to me shop. I left you a thing or two so you can give him hell. I'd like to say we'd meet again over a pint sometime, but well, Godspeed, mate. Didn't he just say he can't see? <laughs> that bolt's just bouncing right off of him. How many times do I gotta shoot him? Shot him once and he fell down. Shot him five times and then he didn't flinch at all. He like learned the pain. Lad, you there? Quinn? Where are you? Getting me ours out of Dodge. Burke's had enough, and he's gunning for you. And I don't intend on being caught in the bloody crossfire. But listen, about the gas. I knew it wasn't easy, but you did what had to be done. Head to me shop. I left you a thing or two so you can give him hell. I'd like to say we'd meet again over a pint of Molded sometime, into but... the pain. Godspeed, mate. Take the fucking ammo! God damn it. Hate this game. Just want the ammo. Lots of dudes. Why are you reloading again? Am I running to him? He asks as I shoot him in the face. I'm already out of combat rifle ammo. It goes so quick.
Taking the same routes I took to get here. London Bridge was falling down. Well, that's really fucking annoying, I'll tell you what. Pocket Secretary. London Bridge is falling down! Yeah, it's coming back. <laughs> I got better. Another one. We're just going to wait for that to fix itself. Uh, are you? Do you know the source of the disturbance? Do you know? Do you see? Is he like above me? Does he know the way? You don't hold these soldiers' lives in high regard, do you, Jensen? No. I'm... Wait, what? Finds out. What? Can he repeat himself? <laughs> Did that actually work? I would much rather be on this angle of things right now, to be honest. Alright, so... I know, right? Super risky. We've gone too far with our little project. But ask yourself, how much further you go to save three to one woman before you judge one? This guy hates women, by the way. <clears throat> the guy uh talking. Oh hello. This, um, little spot sucks. Like, a lot of heavy guys, too. Oh, man. And an alarm now. Yeah, it says more about him than anything. I got exploding... Revolver rounds, so. <laughs> Is he afraid? Wait, oh, he's like invisible. I'm just dumb. Pistol's not the most accurate thing. 
All right. You know. I might not be the smartest when it comes to this, but uh. I'm quite certain he would fly here on a moment's notice. Who the hell's in the mirror? In the mirror don't you? He's responsible in some way for your bloodthirstiness. This is his ass. <laughs> uh, I have to get around this stupid. <laughs> eh, whatever. Well, you made it. I'm torn between admiration and pity. You've condemned me for my actions, Jensen. But look at the lengths you've gone to to find one woman. Wasted potential. Although, from what I've heard, I suspect you'll still be of use to me dead. I'm curious. Gonna have me standing right here? Oh, the MP actually just destroyed it. This guy's kind of weird. They all think I'm, like, right there. He never had any bitches. He's never had them. Zero bitches. So short sighted, disappointing. How could a man so gifted be so blind? Did I actually kill him? Or did I just donk him? Donk. He's like, Howie. You shot me in the face. That's kind of a big old weenie. Boing. So much righteous anger, judge, jury, and executioner, eh, hey, Jensen? Small minded fool. Possible visual. Possible. Oh. I'm curious. How far do you think Dr. Reed would go by? Oh, he's on a loop now. I think you'd be surprised, Jensen. Is he just hanging out in there? Hiding? I can't. That, that couldn't have been him, right? <laughs> That's just some rando. Is that a robot? It's probably gonna like wake up. Somebody must have got him through the window. Yeah, it was just kind of staying there like an idiot, to be honest with you.
God damn. Stop moving. <laughs> Forever. I guess I'll walk down here now. The cargo is people. I don't want the painkillers. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. All right, let's um. <gasps> I do not have confirmation yet. Um. Who's up here? Really? How much ammo did that guy need to take? Level 5 in there. No. That was Burke? Or was Burke actually the guy inside? <laughs> the guy the guy just shot in the head? The doors between here and the docking platform will be open for you. Last time I passed through there, Burke's men were still waiting for me. Not anymore. Burke has just ordered them away. Great. Except I came here looking for Megan Reed, Bratan. I can't leave without knowing. There is a boat heading toward the location as we speak. If you hurry. It can be on it. He was just the idiot standing there? Oh my god. What a fucking idiot. Yo, Burke's revolver? What's the difference? Yeah, I just... I use my little pistol on him. I would rather keep my revolver because it, uh, has exploding rounds. Yeah, okay, I'm not gonna read all that. And yeah, I have, like, no ammo. I had so much before this DLC, like, took it all away from me, I'm gonna be honest. I was like, I finally have all this ammo. Was that stun gun? Yeah, why, why would I still be using the stun gun? I wonder if his, like, righteousness is, like, a little bit dialed back if, uh... That's weird. I wonder if he, like, this doesn't act as self-righteous, uh, if you haven't been killing anybody this entire time. Bratan. Quinn? Oh, we get to I'm meet afraid him. our good friend Quinn met with an unfortunate uh, incident during all the commotion and is no longer with us. Based. Oh, boys, it was you this whole time. Who are you? For the moment, I'm between identities. I apologize for the duplicity, but it was a necessary precaution. You had to be kept in the dark. And Keitner? Did she know? 
Commander Keitner's perception was much like yours, shrouded. She saw what she needed to see, and was told what she needed to hear in order for me to complete the mission. So we were both pawns. Except she's dead and I'm not. So where does that leave me in your grand design? We are all pawns in someone else's grand design, Mr. Jensen. Yeah, I but guess. That doesn't make Natanya's death any less tragic. Your actions ensured her sacrifice was not made in vain, however. Dr. Kavanaugh made it out safely, and is on her way to the rendezvous site. She will expose the truth in due time. Kardner wasn't the only one who died back there. Those prisoners... ...will be added to a long list of Bell Tower's atrocities. We will not let them be forgotten. We mustn't stay here yep. much longer, Mr. Jensen, if we hope to get you away from this base. I still have questions, Quinn. You really want to waste time chatting, Bratan? Fine. Keitner said she... Very astute. One I learned of Commander Keitner's suspicions and insubordinate behavior towards Burke. I saw an opportunity. Pretending to be an agent of Interpol seemed the best way to gain her trust. You mean you lied? So who do you work for? A loose network of independent operatives. Agents of conversion and equilibrium who seek to expose corruption and assure humanity's natural progress. In truth, we are not affiliated with any global organization. But then, neither is our enemy, officially. Your enemy? You're not just talking about Bell Tower anymore, are you? You're talking about... The men and women who pull Bell Tower strings. The same men and women who ordered them to kidnap Megan Reed. All right, let's go. All right. Where's Megan? I don't know for certain. But what I do know is that earlier today, Burke issued orders to have a large group of detainees transferred off this base. Supposedly, they will be assisting at another black site facility. Kavanaugh said this was just the factory floor. You're sure Megan is at this other facility? Nothing is ever certain in life, Mr. Jensen. But it is the best chance you have. Unfortunately, the cargo ship carrying the prisoners has already set sail. But I took the liberty to send out an urgent dispatch in Burke's name, ordering the ship's captain to hold position until one more detainee could be flown on board. In stasis. A helicopter is en route to pick you up. Wait a second. You want me to get inside another stasis pod? Last time I got in one of those things, it didn't go so well. I know, right? I know it's far from ideal, but frankly, your options are quite limited. Although, I suppose you could try swimming there. Better be the right fucking boat this time. Because I don't feel like coming back here anytime soon. Don't worry, man. It'll be grand. Besides, I thought you Americans liked riding off into the sunset. Is it sunset? Man, I feel like I have less upgrades than when I freaking started, man. Like I had this. I had like all of this maxed out. Very long. I could fall from high places. Probably be able to do this. And you know, let's just let's just max out hacking again. Oh. Uh I wanna keep my exploding revolver, to be honest. <laughs> Is this all the ammo that I was taken from me at the start? Alright, machine pistol, machine pistol. Sniper ammo now. Jesus. Let's 
Still no revolver ammo. It's all just like machine pistol ammo. That's it. Oh. Yay, now I have a maxed out inventory. Full of ammo. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No pistol ammo, though, it seems. Nobody uses regular pistols anymore. No more combat rifle. It's a shotgun. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. It's done. Exactly as you instructed. And yet you sound disappointed. You think we should have handled this differently? I think we had a valuable asset in our hands, and we're letting him slip away. He could have been very useful in the coming storm. A hand does not need to be clenched tightly to maintain its hold on someone. Jensen carries too much baggage right now. His obsession with Reed only serves to distract him. We could have told him the truth. He must discover it by himself. And when he does, if you have followed my instructions precisely, we will know how to find him. Assuming he lives that long. What's that about? Richard, any chance you're still there? Jensen, my god. You've been offline for days. Where the hell are you? I was hoping you'd tell me. I'm pinging you now. So this is the regular game now. You're in Singapore. Something's wrong, Jensen. I pinged you, and a second later I lost your GPL signal. It's like you disappeared into a black hole. Gotta be a jammer. Well, obviously. If you can find the transmitter and take it offline, I'll be able to track you. And keep you on a tighter leash. I've got more important things to do than help you keep tabs on me. If Megan and her team are here, there's no time to waste. All righty. We finally got that DLC out of the way. I put it off for quite a while. But, uh, I got work tomorrow, so I gotta wind down. Hit save. It's clicking, man. I do thank you all for tuning in, hanging out, all that great stuff. <laughs>